well. There you go. Hi guys, so um, I just came home from work and I said, Danny, you need to grab the camera because I need to talk about something right now. I'm so irritated. The last two weeks I haven't been sleeping because my cat loves me so much. You guys saw Merlin. He won't leave me alone. So I am at my wit's end right now. So my temper is really hair trigger. Things I wouldn't normally say to people or as harshly <laughs> I'm saying and doing. I was just walking home from work right now and I was reading my book as I was walking and I do that a lot. Most people are like, wow, how can you do that? Not walk into people, ha ha, and it's not that hard. But tonight this guy sitting on a bus stop decided to give me some unsolicited advice that fucking pisses me off when people do that. Because you have no idea who you're talking to. I'm just some random person. I have no reason to listen to you. You're like, you know, that's not very good for your eyes to do that, you know. And because I'm trying to keep my temper, I said, it's all good, my man. And I keep walking. And he's, no, really, it's not good for your eyes. And without even thinking, I couldn't stop myself. I just slammed my book shut, turned around, and I said, you know what? You can go fuck yourself. And normally I wouldn't be quite so vehement about something. Maybe I would have turned around and said... Do you normally give out advice to complete strangers that they don't want? Because you're an arrogant prick if you do. But I just snapped on this guy. And I, I felt like I was going to go over and just snap his neck. Because people who give out unsolicited advice... Who, who Seriously, who do you think you are? Are you, are you a therapist and you think you have to save everybody? Because I, I am not interested in listening to what you have to say. And I understand that I'm extremely tired... And like I said, my temper is hair trigger right now. And as such, I'm going to have to lock my cat up in the bathroom at night, which I hate doing because I cannot sleep if he's in my face, meowing and licking my face at 3 in the morning until 7. So I can't sleep no matter what. But I have a performance on Saturday, so my stress levels are really, really high. Anyway. This rant is specifically about people who give unsolicited advice. If you are someone who does that, you feel the absolute compulsion that you cannot let someone walk by you or hear someone tell a story and you cannot not keep your mouth shut, you really need to think about the fact that not everybody wants to hear what you have to say. Because I really don't, especially if you're a stranger, because I don't give a shit about you um, you're running the cap all over my foot. Well, he's trying to be all artistic, and he's just kicking. Anyway. I'm irritated with Danny to no end right now because I'm so tired, and he can't breathe without me snapping at him, so I'm sorry about that, by the way. Anyway. Unsolicited advice. Fuck you. I'm done. And hit stop anytime. He wants to see how far I'm going to go before I punch him. <laughs>